Trial began today for former IBEW Local 1260 union leader Brian Aha Coelho in the conspiracy case alleging the misuse of union dues. Christy Tomashiro reports. Brian Ahakuelo in the suit and his wife Marilyn Ahakuelo in the beige had little to say while exiting federal court Friday. Hey, it was a great day in court today. The couple, along with Brian's sister-in-law, Jennifer and Stancion, faced a jury. Charges include conspiracy, wire fraud, embezzlement, and vote rigging. Federal prosecutors said in their opening argument, the defendants used IBEW Local 1260 as their personal piggy bank. They did it to enrich themselves and family members at the union's dispense. What's going to be the challenge for the government is they're going to have to prove um, that there was a nefarious intent going on uh, behind Mr. Ahakuelo's expenditures. Um, and sometimes you can just see it because of the type of expense it was or how often it was or how lavish it was. The prosecution says it'll bring in evidence to show that Ahakuelo rigged a union vote to raise members' dues to benefit himself. But the defense says Brian Ahakuelo and his family did everything in the best interest of the union. The defense said in their opening argument, the international IBEW is corrupt by two things, power and money. The international did vote rigging and not Brian. And Brian spending money and traveling with entourages was all part of doing business successfully. The defense is going to lie on what the bylaws say. If the bylaws permitted these defendants to obtain property and use it, for their personal use, even though they were still using it for the benefit of the union or the union members, then that's going to be a strong defense that favors the defendants. The prosecution called on their first witness, chief of staff of the international IBEW. Experts say unions can be hard to understand at times. Painting the picture for the jury will help the prosecution. Going to the international union is very important because that puts a structure on what was allowed for Mr. Ahakuelo and his family and what wasn't allowed. Trial will continue on Tuesday. Christy Tomashiro, KH2 News, working for Hawaii.